Hey, Happy New Year, Brighton. I hope you had a great Christmas and New Year. Let's make 2023 your best year ever, bringing you a market update. And also I wanted to bring you some value. So we have a new tool, it's called howsmyvalue.com. Com. Simply visit, because here's what I believe heading into 2023. In this newly and ever-changing market is homeowners need to understand their value more than ever before, right? Because we know that uh, you could call five different realtors and probably get five different opinions. If you're thinking about selling, even really if you're thinking about buying, learning and understanding the pricing that's going on in the market, the trends is going to help you make great choices. So with that said, howsmyvalue.com, plug in your info. Uh, it's gonna give you the value of your home, but also it's going to email you every time there's a change to that value. It's once a month, or if there's something that happens in your immediate area. Really cool tool, totally free, and we're not gonna bug you with it, right? Uh, just plug in your data and enjoy that tool. So let's jump into the data here for December of 2022 versus December of 2021. Now we've been doing these videos every month because again, I just think it's gonna be really important that, I mean, I do this all the time, our agents do this all the time because we need to know what is happening with values and how it's changing and how they're affecting the market or the market is affecting the values. So I wanted to make sure that you had this info as well. Um, but December average sales price, so listen, in Brighton, we have two zip codes, 114, 116. On average, these are, uh, the December average sales price is up 7% between these two zip codes. So positive information there. And you know, we've been doing these for all of the markets that we serve and we're consistently seeing the same thing. The data has not yet shown what the news has been telling us, right? So uh, obviously a good thing there if you're thinking about making a move in 2023. December, the number of homes for sale. Now this is uh, this has changed a little bit, not a ton, but again, I always I always talk about when we talk about December, January, February, especially for sellers. Most people don't list during those times of the year unless it's out of necessity, right? But also based on the weather, often that changes. You know, you get a snowstorm, you have big storms uh, that last a week or two. Obviously that slows it down. You could have a very mild December and that would speed up the listing. Anyway, the data tells us that um, 116 is up 15%, 50% more homes for sale, 114 is basically the same. So again, positive signs. The average days on the market. This one is really interesting because we're seeing this across all of the markets is that the days on the market is getting reduced. You know, again, we're hearing you know, interest rates, we're hearing all of these things, homes are sitting, they're not. Both markets are down uh, on average about 25% of the days on market. <clears throat> new listings. So these are new homes listed in the month of December. Basically the same as 2021. You know, it's interesting because when, when you look at the data and you're able to make decisions based on the data, instead of the news, you get to see a real clear picture that the market is very similar to what it was last year. Uh, here we are, number of new listings, and it's basically a change of 1% between the two zip codes. Average price per square foot up 10.5% between the two markets. So again, another positive sign, values continuing to increase. Average sales price up from $198 a square foot to 220. As always guys, um, we're just here to help. If you have questions, maybe you'd like to dive a little bit deeper on your specific home, on your maybe your area, the lake you live on, whatever that may be, you're welcome to reach out to us. Uh, that, that's certainly a free service to give you an in-home market analysis. That's how you're always gonna get the most accurate pricing. But again, let's make 2023 our best year ever. Let's stay focused, let's stay positive, and let's make things happen. Thank you so much guys, John Wentworth.